Hello everybody, my name is Peter. I decided to make this film about setting up the Litra car bike. So behind me as you can see the patient which I'll be working with tomorrow. So this is a Scott bike, hybrid version with 28 inch uh, wheels. Uh, I can make a little cup on this. So here you can see all the details, hydraulic brakes. Nine gear. The rain look set. So tomorrow I will show you how to make this and turn this bike into an electrical one. Here you can see all the parts prepared for the job. Buffer motor and the battery. In addition to this we will replace all the wheels, as you can see, they are worn. So for the electric car bikes, it's really recommended to change them to the proper one. And here you can see tires from Schwalbe. It's a really good company, and I bought tires specially made for electric car bikes. Uh, E-bike ready, they call it, and so far certified up to 50 kilometers per hour. And the size is 37. So yeah. So tomorrow we'll see how to put it all together. Today is the next day of uh, changing this patient to the electrical bike. So. I will just show you quickly what I'll be doing today with this. So first of all, we need to prepare this bike for cleaning. So I will disassemble the unnecessary parts. So the first thing goes is the heart of the bike. So the chain ring, the chain. We will replace this with the motor. So we will not need this anymore. And we will remove the, the front derailleur and the uh, gear shifter <laughs> Installing new tires on these rims. So, yeah, I find that's the most difficult part because tires are very tight, especially the small diameter. In this case, we'll see they're made for hybrid bikes, and it's dimension 37. So, we'll see. <laughs> Installation. Here you can see the package. So it includes all the necessary tools. There's a bunch of screws, arms. All these parts will come later on. And 
here is the motor. So as you can see, this part will go into the crank component, which is here. All right. Here is display panel for go on the steering wheel, at which will be controlling all the parameters of this motor. First thing we need to install this bracket. And here's the battery. So this mounting bracket will go here on the frame. To raise the bike to show it better. Here you can see the sockets for screws. This bracket is going here. Then I need to tighten everything and put the battery in. Okay. What I'm doing now is shorting the cables from the battery to the motor. You can see they're quite excessive, so I need to shorten them. So this will mean I'll have to make you know, like new leads. So let's have a look how to do this.
Okay. So the battery is installed and connected uh, the motor. Here you can see how it looks. So this cable coming from the battery to the motor. Here you can see the seal. So the connection, the leads are protected from the water. The motor works well. Here you can see the test. Okay, then we press the thump, the motor starts rolling. Okay, so let's put all the rest of the parts together and yeah, we will set up everything then. shield so it's time to install the chain now so let's go ahead okay so the assembly is almost ready now is the time let's see all the steering units installed and the braking sensors So now is the time to program the motor. So here is the special cable connected to the motor. And then you connect it to the computer. And there is a the software. Ladies and gentlemen, bike is completed. I'll just make a quick tour around all different items. show you this in operation. And the analysis works as well. And that's all. <laughs> <laughs>